CDC declaring the war has changed against the virus and in an internal CDC document that was leaked, researchers say the Delta variant is as contagious as the chicken pox, even among the vaccinated. 11 Allies' Brittany Klein-Peter spoke with the chief of Emory Medical Services about this new research and what it means for you. The Center for Disease Control and Prevention is issuing a stern warning about the Delta variant following new research, some preliminary that was leaked overnight. The agency admitting that even fully vaccinated people can spread the Delta variant as easily as unvaccinated people. The variant is now the dominant strain of the virus in Georgia, likely making up anywhere from 50 to 75 percent of new cases, according to the state. And like the chicken pox, each infected person can spread the variant strain to eight to nine other people. At the end of 10 cycles of reproduction, you infect about 30 million people. In comparison, Dr. Carlos Del Rio says the original strain of the virus that was first detected in Wuhan would only infect 9,000 people at the end of 10 cycles. But while you may still pass along the Delta variant if you're vaccinated, the CDC document reaffirms the vaccine's ability to keep you from getting sick. If you're vaccinated, you're in good shape. In other words, you're, you're still fairly well protected against infection and you're really well protected in the 90% range against severe disease and death. The document goes on to say that vaccination alone won't stop the Delta variant or future variants from spreading. And for that very reason, even vaccinated people should be wearing masks. These new details explaining the scientific background behind the agency's change in mask guidance earlier this week. If you're not vaccinated, you're gonna get infected. I mean, this variant will find you. This, this variant is highly transmissible. You can be in a room with somebody few minutes, you're going to get infected. The document also says that until almost everyone is fully vaccinated, they don't believe that the virus will stop spreading. And with children under 12 still not eligible to get a vaccine, they're saying that anyone taking care of children should be wearing masks regardless of their vaccination status. A very important piece of information for parents as they prepare to send their kids back to school.